I came in um, to Lehigh Valley Dermatology about two years ago because I had a, a spot on my temple that had been there for about four or five years, come and gone. Not only did they determine that I had basal cell uh, cancer there, that I actually had um, a melanoma on my neck. Much of what we do at the office every day is centered around skin cancer checks. Typically we take into account risk factors for skin cancer, be that your skin type, if you're fair or more dark, if you have a lot of pigmented lesions to begin with, if you have any family history of skin cancer, any history of significant sunburns or artificial tanning, that might increase your risk for skin cancer. Quite honestly there has been no history of skin cancer in my family. So the fact that I was the first of my parents or my sister was maybe a little bit of a surprise. He has history of significant sun exposure, light eyes, and light hair. Uh, he also has an increased number of moles. Typically, what we're interested in uh, is the ABCDs of melanoma. We're looking for moles to be symmetrical, asymmetry is A, to have regular borders, border is B, to have uniform color throughout, C is color, and also that in general, all of your moles are in the same color family. D is diameter. Typically, we like moles to be smaller than the size of a pencil eraser. And E is evolving, so we're always concerned about any mole by history of the patient getting larger or darker. So have you noticed anything new or different that you're concerned about? At this point, I'm every six months, and I'm sure it'll be that way unless, or in a, I'm sure annually, at the very least for the rest of my life. Lehigh Valley Dermatology is fantastic. From the very beginning, the care that Dr. Vasily, Sarah, and, and Dr. Senef, who did my Mo surgery, has been wonderful. And quite honestly, they uh, were the dermatologists for my wife all growing up. So there's a long history here for our family, and we're very appreciative of, of how they've cared for us. Mm -hmm.